All right, Rachel, you're the one I want to spend the rest of my life with, and you're truly my best friend. You are truly one of the most genuine and kind, loving people this world has to offer. I know I like to joke with my friends about saving you from the mice infestation at your place, uh, but tr uh, the truth is you actually saved me. You have shown me all the good things that this world has to offer, from Greece to even a last minute road trip to Texas. There's no one else I'd rather go through on these trips for the rest of our life with and all the adventures to come. I know my mom couldn't be here today, but I know she would have been proud of the woman I married. And I know that she would be proud that, she's, that I found someone that shares her kindness, generosity to others, and lack of judgment. Truly a pure heart. If I know myself like I do, I'm probably crying right now. <laughs> so here are some funny vows to lighten the mood. I vow to always watch a bachelor and bachelorette with you. Yes. <laughs> but I do draw the line at Bachelor in Paradise. <laughs> it's a terrible show. <laughs> I vow to always give you the majority of blankets when you're cold at night and set the thermostat to 75 even though I like it colder. But in all honesty, I vow to work my hardest to support you in the future life we will build together and our family will have one day in the future. And in 50 years, I vow that you'll still look at me the same way that you look today with the same level of love and respect. My heart is yours and always will be. I love you. Weddings are about celebrating a union, but what going through this process of wedding planning has taught me is that while the big day may be special, it's the moments leading up that show you who you marry. We work so hard together to plan this destination <laughs> wedding, and like life, we truly are amazing partners. This incredible weekend attests to just how strong of partners we are. Brendan, there's so much about you that is amazing, and it's not just the obvious stuff about how you were a naval officer or how you got your, off your master's degree while working and graduating at the top of your class or that you're an incredible kickball player. It's how you are at home behind closed doors that made me fall in love with you so easily. It's the fact that while I was working on this weekend, you it's the fact that while I was working on the weekend, you cleaned out the master closet, put your clothes in the guest closet on your day off because you knew how much I love clothes. You've graciously given up not one, but two walk-in closets due to my obsession. It's how when you have an incredibly hard day at work, you're still eager to come home, go on an adventure because you know it may be the only time that week with my crazy schedule. It's how when I felt beaten down by my job, you bought a book of adventure date ideas we could do together to cheer me up. It's how you buy me flowers at the grocery store to add color to our day-to-day -day life. It's how you make these small gestures all the time. Life with you never gets boring. You make the most mundane parts of life so incredibly fun, and I can't wait to do all the mundane things together, as well as explore the world and life as one. I can't imagine life without you, and I'm so glad I don't have to. I promise to love you unconditionally and to be there as your partner during good times and bad. I promise to love you even when you destroy our bathroom multiple times in one night. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I promise to put our marriage and family first. I promise to love you forever no matter what state we live in. There's no doubt you're the love of my life and I'm so happy today we, we get to make this love and partnership partnership official. Everybody watching the video now knows I have a, <laughs> I have a problem. <laughs> I love, oh, I love you too. I love you.
always fascinated to hear Brennan talk about his potential future wife every single day. But know that Brendan's probably think, been thinking about this day much longer than you, Rachel. <laughs> come to think of it, come to think of it, my perceptions of Brendan both play on each other. Taken for somebody who is also recently married, to love someone requires commitment, requires loyalty. It requires compassion and a kind, under, kind and understanding heart. It requires flowers on retainer. And Brendan couldn't fit the bill more for a perfect friend or a perfect partner in life. So with that, I would love to toast, have the first toast to the lovely couple, Mr. and Mrs. Brendan Page. Hi, Brendan. With this ring, I, Brendan, take you, Rachel, to be my wife. Take you, Rachel, to be my wife. I will share my life with yours. I will share my life with yours. And build our dreams together. And build my dreams together. Support you through build, <laughs> build our dreams together. <laughs> she is my dream, all right? With this ring. With this ring. I, Rachel. I, Rachel. Take you, Brendan. Take you, Brendan. To be my husband. To be my husband. I will share my life with yours. I will share my life with yours. And build our dreams together. And build our dreams together. Support you through times of trouble. Support you through times of trouble. What kind of guy do you think you're going to marry? No, I, I don't know. I was like, I hope he likes dogs. You know? <laughs> and Rachel has this list, like, thought out. And I was like, well, what are a couple of your things? You know, she's listing them off. And, and I'm like, yeah, good luck. You know? <laughs> and honestly, Brendan, you have every single one of those qualities and then some. And, you know, growing up with Rachel and seeing, like, I knew how amazing Rachel was, I feel like, before she did. And I feel like now we have, like, reached a point where Rachel has truly blossomed and she has become just such an incredible woman, leader, nurse. And Brendan, like, I can't thank you enough being the protective sister, knowing that she is, like, the best person she has ever been since being with you. And, you know, I just thank everybody for coming and supporting you guys because what you have is so unique and so special. And so on that note, I would love to make a toast. And a testament to one good decision is Brendan, of course. He's an excellent man. And I can say, with all sincerity, I'm a very proud father-in-law. <laughs> you guys are going to make a great couple, and you're embarking on a great journey. I can't thank you enough, and I can't thank everyone here. I met all you guys. You guys are in the. It's not just these two that are joining, but it's our families that are joining together. We are all family and friends. And if you come along and see, please say hi to me, and I'll do the same. So it's been a pleasure. So I want to last off say this toast to everyone. Let's toast Brendan because, and Rachel, because I think they, to me, they inspire us all. Thank you.